Oh, fresh off is winning with the alternates. This is probably definitely no less tense because Wario does have the waft and is uh, super strong. Wario got the juice, bro. He got the juice and the gas. True, true. I wonder if the juice gave him gas. Well, the juice, de something's giving him gas, and it might be <laughs> eating that bu the bike. We'll see if he tries to eat some... Uh, I wonder if the bike's diesel, you know what I'm saying? He's going to eat the PK Flash. That's tough. Zero. Throwing out that PK Flash a lot. Yeah, and it's been doing him many, many favors. But at the same time, you know, he's a loser. So he's got to think about his options. Can't, can't get too wild just yet. Oh, looking for that F smash. And that's going to gonna get that forward throw punish. I don't yeah. see why, if you're a Ness player, just always throw out the back throw. It'll give you way better advantage. The back throw? Like, yeah. No, because you don't want to stale it. Yeah, you never want to stale it. I mean, you don't want to stale it, but you you also shouldn't be, like, going for grabs that often, right? R well, yes, but it's like you also have, like, other, like, down throws also, like, decent into some stuff. Whoa! Yeah. He going for these PK rockets every single time, and people are just not respecting it enough. Matador gets ca caught way out. Hey, bro. He hit him with the smoke. Yeah. And now he's trying to fish for some down tilt to go to dash attack, but it's like Zerom spacing himself out just far enough. It's too late now, bro. Zerom already on that streak. He played He played that He played that Little Mac, and now he's just like... Yeah, I mean, because that's the thing. that Playing Little Mac makes you play so on point that now he's, like, in a good headspace. Oh, he's my like, God. Okay, loops around, but this time the bike decreases the distance that he goes from the PK rocket. So literally, if you hit anything with PK Thunder 2, it decreases the distance that you go, and it actually is a really good uh, a move for you to just throw a good projectile, especially one with a lot of hit stun like a bike. I was about to say, I'm interested to see what projectiles do that. Yeah, so like, like melon. Melon is a really good one. Stuff with a lot of hit stun when you when you do it. Like anything that extends hit for a long time, like Hydrant when it's launched, a melon is really good. Um, <laughs> just some other stuff. You sound like a Pac-Man. I name. know, I know. It's like, hey, that's what I know. That's what I know. Yep, see, back it up. There we go. Right, exactly. And that time, obviously, is like, you know, you, you don't want to use it enough. It's just, it's a last resort. For sure, for sure. It's like if you're at that percent, it's like, I really don't want to go for anything else. It's like, I just go for the, the back throw. Oh, whoa. Matter throw is already on last time? Yes, he is because he got hit. He got hit with that PK Thunder too, way too early, and 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 died for it. Oh wow! Well, okay, so the da so the get up attack actually beats out the yo-yo. Okay. I knew it would beat out yo-yo. Well, yeah, but I he. I thought he was gonna lose the invincibility frame. Yeah, right. it, it hung around for a lot longer than I anticipated. Okay, reversing that PK flash, oh. forcing Matador to think about his options and get the air dodge. Okay. Wow. But watch out for the bike. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. So he has to watch out for the up smash, too. I think that head is a bit more scary than uh, that bike. It can be. But, you know, that that bike is a kill move itself. You know, you, yeah. Ooh. So there you go. See? Obviously, now it's like, well, you got to watch out. Uh, okay, there you go. So this time... Space the yo -yo just a bit better. Right. He was he was a little bit farther into the ledge, and that helped him a lot because whenever Manador tried to get up, like, I mean, you just get caught with that, that hitbox, and it's just like... It's still it's still a good option, even though it had been nerfed, you know, a few, you know, quite a quite a while ago actually, like a, quite a few patches ago, um, it got nerfed and it's still a good option. Zerum knows when to go for it. Obviously, it's for like sure. you relearn you relearn your habits and everything. You don't want to go for it like too much because you can't hold it for as long. So it's like you can't. Is that like, what they nerfed? The duration. Right. So the charge it charges uh, quicker. So you can't char you can't hold, sit it there like charging for a while. You have to let it go. I don't know, dog. That move's still pretty darn good. No, it's super good. And obviously, if you hit it with anything, like it invalidates the hitbox. So it's like, that's a good way. Like, obviously, that's why Manador is going for the getup attack. Gotcha, gotcha. Understood. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get into game two. Right. Zero, I'm taking that game one. This man. Hey. If you're able to ever beat Alternus, he is the de he's the cheat code. If you can beat him, you just gonna win everything. Cause true. He puts you on your A game if you right. can beat him. I mean, it wasn't Tengu tonight, right? I mean, Tengu was you know one of the one of the other favorites to win tonight, and he obviously had to get you know he got knocked out. So it's like now someone else, either you know Zero, Matador, Iota, someone's gonna someone's gonna pull it back. Now that the terror is gone, we'll yeah, see how right. It goes. Zerum did his job. He got the run back. That's what you want. And now he's just got to get through. We see Matador playing a lot more spacey this match. Yeah, for sure. He, he's he's trying to turn it back on. He's Is that an up throw? Yeah. I legitimately don't think I've ever seen it. Yeah, I, I don't think so either, but... I mean, it kind of looked prior. Oh, my God. That spike into back air. 
He did that a bit earlier in the last match as well. Wow, and I think that was crazy. Zero really trying to two frame him with PK Thunder 2. That is wow. absolutely the oh ball. They're gonna fight the ledge and uh Zero's gonna go ahead and win that one. Right. Pretty handily. Obviously now he's sitting at 100 percent off stage. This could be pretty bad, but Manador doesn't really want to contest too hard because you don't want to get hit with that PK Thunder. It's just not worth it. As good as like Wario Dare is off stage, you have to make sure that you're gonna oh hit him goodness. before he can hit you. And it's just not worth it if you if you mistime it even by half a second. Zerom is on one right now. I know, that's it. So that clears it. I mean he had no bike, so that was it. I mean, there was nothing he could have done, no horizontal mobility, no upbeat to get you back far enough, that's it. Matador is on his last stop. Yeah, well, exactly. Zerom's still on his third. Right. Not impossible, but Right, Zerum definitely pulled the momentum like super back in his favor. Uh, okay. Hey, bro, what is ledge? Didn't Zero. expect that to go above ledge, but that is a mix-up. Yeah, that I is was definitely not either. A mix up. Two Peaky Thunders going for that F tilt. Oh, again! God, Matador kind of smiling that one off, but it's like, God, that's gonna be so tilting. God, that's gonna be so. <laughs> I would, I would be so angry. Are you tilted right twice? now? Twice. I, I feel like you're like, tilted. I'm serious. Twice in this set already. Three times in the past 30 minutes? That's crazy. Zerom's going look at, wild, Look at Zerom. Look at that smirk. Dude, he is going he's wild. This man is crazy. I respect it. I, I have to because it's like that's what's... Dude, that's, yes. I, anything. I mean like, tea, I don't know, tea, water, anything, man. Oh, man. Okay, so we're going to town and city, and this is interesting, so... I'm, I don't know if this I don't is really know why trick, we didn't though. go to Smashville. Why? Maybe okay. Zero probably banned Smashville actually. Yeah, I think he would have. I think he would have been better off looking for those uh, smaller stages. Yeah, and that's the thing. There's not a lot of smaller stages these days. It's mostly just Smashville and maybe Battlefield, but that's about it. Thank you. I don't yeah. know. Getting him back here to get him off stage, and here comes the downer. Finally catching him uh, just before the PK Thunder comes out. That oh. is an SD. All right, so. Matador looking better off this match. Right. He does have a long way to go if he wants to win this set, but not impossible. Yeah, I don't know. The PK Fire is definitely going to create some uh, ledge shenanigans there. Matador going really hard in with the bike. Uh, definitely an interesting approach tool. I mean, it's, it, it can be good, and obviously the wheelie is really good if you can get that, but... <laughs> At the local sense, it doesn't matter. Zero is not feeling that bike, clearly. Certainly not. And it doesn't re- I mean, it re recharges. Whoa, okay. Going okay. off stage for that. But, I mean, the bike only recharges in like five, six seconds or something. So. Whoa! <laughs> you just hear- You just hear the fart and the taunt! The taunt on ledge! Alright, Matador switches. Matador it pulls it back! Matador almost like- What is happening?! Uh, no. Troll, lol, lol, lol. Okay, so no three stock. <laughs> okay, Matador said no, <laughs> no, none of that, none of that, no he more. Clapped him like he was a fly swatter. I was like, enough of that, even your BS. And then it really is a good option. Like, if you're quick on the uptake and be like, all right, all right, I, I can stop. Big disjoints are, are, are good. But all right, Zero, I'm starting to starting to come back into this mm. match. We'll see. He is. He's really coming back with that PK flash. Two PK thunders into a third PK. Uh, another. Well, okay, this time it didn't connect, but. I thought, man. I thought he was gonna let it go, and it would have slapped that man. Matador going way deep below stage, but now no bike. It's just gone, and, and you die. Just like that, we're back to a one-to-one -one stock situation. Yeah, but the plats are going away. FT time. That's something that Zero definitely should take advantage of. He doesn't have to worry about him running away with those platforms, so he can right. just kind of zone him in with those uh, projectiles, especially right. that PK fire. Right, right, and since he used the waft earlier, um, this is like a baby waft. It was just like, uh, ooh, angle down. He was F looking for that re grab, and <laughs> exactly. He didn't yeah, yeah. Have any eye frames. Right, exactly. Going for the re grab is uh, a very risky play, especially against Wario on ledge. Like when he's there, ready to F tilt you. Yeah, yeah. That's, yeah. That's they've seen Matador all night just. Yeah, I mean, he's going for it even when he's not expecting a re-grab. So it's like the fact that he was expecting a re-grab is like, yeah, you should definitely be ready yeah, for that. For sure, for sure. Going back to PS2, now that Zerum's got the stage counter pick, I'm wondering, like, obviously I don't think Town and City really, like, did anyone any favors. It was just a lot of shenanigans that last game. So it's like, I, I don't know. Matador got a really quick lead in that last game, and then 
you know, kind of coasted. Oh, Matador was about to lose. He just uh, he just switched back to the regular default skin. <laughs> it was the biker that. They, uh, so you think the biker is the move? Honestly, I like regular Wario. I think it's classic, man. The classic. The biker is definitely El Classico. the uh, This is game four. Zerom. Right, Zerom is up 2-1 right now, and he's looking to close it out and get right back into the uh, grand finals. We'll see what happens. But. All right, so Zerom just kind of fishing for his recovery. Uh, yeah, a little bit. War, uh, Matador is kind of stepping him out really intensively. Yeah, even Matador ready to get rid of that bike, get, get it recharged so you can start using it for approaches. Oh, really deep with the down air. This time has to tech that and Ooh. then barely gets back with the up B. The magnet hand's helping him out just a tiny bit. The Matador looking to seal out this first stock as quickly as possible. Whoa, that bike. And oh. then he, wow. So literally, so he threw the bike so close to stage that Zerum had to get close, but he got so close that he bumped the PK Thunder on the stage and it died for it. Wow. That was definitely a really, really good bait by uh, by Matador there. And the bike play again, coming in clutch yet again. Oh man, that drift is just so good. So we're gonna, we're gonna see Matador gonna try and recreate last match. If I think Zer if Zerom's able to like keep it a bit closer than it was before. Oh my God! On platform, barely, barely alive. Hey, this time he will die. All right, so Matador Looking making like it last look game. just exactly like last game. Back down to the last stock situation, but we know that Zerom can run it back. So. But it was yeah, this one this one's moving in a little bit slower motion. I think the last one was really quick, two stocks, and then all of a sudden now, uh, it's it's taking a little bit more time. Matador is ready to, to, to coast on his lead yet again. Um, he's sitting at 151. Zerum having a, a difficult time trying to go for the grab or other other things. You know, it's like the, the, the Nest specials. Matador, Matador doesn't have to approach. Yeah, he is definitely having a more difficult time trying to just seal out this stuff. Yeah, yeah. Finally, you know, no, he's, he, saw, he saw the whip on the chomp. Yeah, the whiff on the chomp was enough. And it's just like, okay, look, like you, you really went for it too long. Matador waiting it out, trying to charge that waff just a little bit longer. <laughs> you know, on the angel platform, you gotta go for it. All right, get, getting some combos. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh my, oh my god. god. Yeah, the 70%. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> you crazy, man. You crazy. I mean, he would have died whether he got that or not, but that, that would have been God, you crazy. That would have been hot. <laughs> You <laughs> just threw it away. It's like, ha, it doesn't really matter. Go to Zero game five. Zerum is that dude, bro. Zerum is that dude. He goes for... That's what's up, dog. And, and sometimes Matador is that dude, too. Hey, hey. Matador can be that hey. dude, too, the way he goes into the Step loss sometimes. Step away from the game a second. At the end of the day, this is just a game. Yeah. You can get really tilted, but remember, you playing this game because you enjoy it. Yeah. So stick to that. All right. Oh, is it my turn to get on the soapbox? Oh, um, so play, Shut up. <laughs> play, play Skull Girls. <laughs> Got him! Got him! Got him! Okay, anyway, let's go. <laughs> That's my soapbox for the day. We had, we all had to get we all had to get you know something something random to, to talk about, I guess. <laughs> Nah, man. Sometimes anyway. you just be getting tilted all day, and that's not that's not what this is about. Yeah, 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 for sure. We, uh, we always have to be a little cheeky sometimes. Yeah, for a little sure. tongue in cheek, you know what I mean. And this is uh, very tongue in cheek. Going for the third oh up air. God. Let's go, Zerom. Going for it again. But you know that move. Forty-nine percent for free. That move was extra stale. Forty-nine percent. Eh, yeah, but eh, who cares? Yeah. Everything else is fresh. You True. steal, you steal that. Everything else is fresh. <laughs> That's exactly, that's the tech. That's Ooh. the tech. Third eye open. You throw out one move ten times, and all of a sudden, everything else is fresh. You just go <laughs> for something else and get the kill. I don't know. No, don't do that. Uh, forward throw? Yeah, the forward throw. Just get a little bit of stage presence. You know, it's like you want to you know, just get him off stage and then try to play something off of it. Obviously, Matador's not going to Every time you see one. that, oh, my. is that death? Okay. Uh, but that's death. God, that back air. In the blast zone. That melon. That melon. The big hat. Trying to okay. He's trying to knock that melon in. Yeah, yeah, Get yeah. it? Oh, very <laughs> clever. Oh, very clever. Uh, very I'm clever. sorry. That was terrible. Anyway. Ooh. Okay, so I, I respect um, Matador. Ooh. The, bike. the bike throw up is really good for... Oh, God. Oh, here it goes. He's here. spazzing out with the bike. Okay. Oh. And that's a lot of damage. Ah. <laughs> 
And I love that. I love the war. And that is how Zero feels about that bike. It does, yeah, for sure. That's how we all feel about the bike. I don't mind it. Wow, the big back air again. Meeting him in the skies yet again. Oh, what happened? Okay. Okay. Hey, man. The alternate. Are you crazy? Oh. He parries! <laughs> Bruh. This is crazy. Oh, down air. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. Again. Matador up yet again for the third game in a row. Three stocks to one at 150. And then, of course, dies. But the, he's sitting on the lead. All right. So we. This. These past, this game and this? the past two have been just a repeat of it, of it, pretty much itself. Especially now that we're back on town and city, it's the same thing's happening again. The waft, and that's it. Are you oh, kidding me? My goodness. So Matador are gonna pull it back with the reverse, reverse three on. No. Okay, that's crazy. Okay. Uh. All right, and this <sighs> is this is 